Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is a hair review, and I'm very upset. So let's get right into it. I've been meaning to record this video for months. I've had this hair since March. Well, I've actually, yes, yeah, since March. And I'm just not getting to record it because, well, watch the last video and you'll figure out, you'll, you know, you'll hear why. But anyways, this hair is from Slove Hair. It is, I'll put the link to the hair in the bottom. And I'll put pictures of me wearing the hair in here somewhere. The hair is supposed to be straight, but I'll, I'll, I'll tell you what I did. So, let me tell you the backstory on this hair. So, I got this hair for my birthday. I was turning 19, the nasty 19. You know, I wanted to look cute. I wanted to look good. I was like, middle part. We're going to switch it up. Straight middle part. I look so good. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. So, I got this hair, right? And so, I, I, I waited. I waited till the week before my birthday to wear the hair because I was like, I'm really about to pull it out on the boys. Like they don't even understand what's gonna come their way. So I pulled the hair out or whatever. And so the first day I wore it, it was looking fine or whatever, but I went out. I started, my birthday was on Friday. So I started wearing it the Saturday before my birthday. Yeah, I started wearing it the Saturday before my birthday. Whole day I spent like plucking the part, all of that all of that sewing extra combs in it because now LA Express wigs only come frontal style they don't come with the combs in the front I don't know why so I was showing the combs in if y'all want to see how I do that just let me know so I spent all day doing that and so that night I went out so I was in situations where I was at parties and stuff and it was very humid very hot all of that so the hair got very tangled and I was like that's odd especially because I've had slow hair before that bob and that bob is actually a really good wig the only reason I don't wear it now is because a lot of my wigs I wasn't able to store properly watch the last video you know that'll let you know why so a lot of my wigs got ruined but this wig definitely got stored properly I kept it because it was my wig it was like the wig for the rest of the year it was it was it so um I was like that's a little odd that it just got like frizzy like I mean, my bob actually you know what the bob did get frizzy the bob did get frizzy sometimes, but I guess since it was short hair, it just wasn't as bad. But this one just wasn't, just wasn't a good look. So, and I'll probably like insert a picture or something of me that night or a video or something of the sort, right? So, I continue to wear the hair and it's behaving weird. Like, it's behaving like, like it's hair that I've had for like a month, but I've only had it for like a week. And so, by the time my birthday gets there, the hair just doesn't look as nice. You know, I was still rocking it anyways, but it just wasn't as nice. And it was like, after a while, I, I tried to wash it like twice and it got worse every time I tried to wash it, like every time. And now the hair feels actually like kind of soft, but it's still kind of like tangling, shedding, all of that. Um, and that's because I boiled the hair when I got back home from college. I boiled the hair and washed in all of that, like to try to get all the whatever was making it act like that out um but yeah this hair was just like overall awful like it used to shed so much oh my goodness and living in that little dorm room of mine hair would be everywhere it would drive me insane i couldn't like brush my hair in public because hair would be all over the floor and oh my gosh i would like curl my hair because and when in doubt if you have a wig that's acting up when in doubt just curl it and it'll just you know it'll be wavy or whatever no ma'am no ham no turkey this hair got so like frizzy and it was just like it was so ugly and it was like i was stressed out so i really wasn't even in the position to care to try to fix it and i was just like this is the worst hair i've ever gotten from, from aliexpress and it truly is like the worst not maybe not the worst hair but the worst wig yeah yeah worst wig i've ever gotten from aliexpress um um four out of ten if you want to have a wig that you throw on once a month, then hey, go for it. But if you only wear this wig every day, mm -mm. no ma'am, no ham, no turkey. Like, no, like, would not recommend. I paid for this wig with my own. Well, was it with my? It was my mama's money. I don't make any money to be buying my own hair. But my mom paid for this wig for my birthday, and I was supposed to be feeling confident and having long Pocahontas locks. And I didn't. The hair, I don't know how what inches I got it in. It was like either 26 or 24. I had to cut some of the ends off because it was just so tattered and just ugly. And it was just uh, like, I just, and it was so beautiful when I first got it. Like I did a Snapchat video. I'm going to insert the Snapchat video. It was so pretty. Like I was just like, I can't believe what it has, what it has come to. Like, are you kidding me? Like the hair was so awful. Like, 
and from slow because my bob is still like my bob is probably the only wig that i could still probably throw on to this day even though i'm about to start my wig collection over again because i just didn't store my wigs properly but this one got stored properly so there's no excuse for that um so yeah this is super annoying um i wouldn't recommend this hair thank you guys for watching this video i hope you guys enjoyed it and i will see you guys in the next one